the proxy pattern. So the idea behind proxy is that we want to get a placeholder for another object in order to control it. So this placeholder should be transparent. So it should have the same interface as the original object. So um, as you see in the, in the diagram, so a client calls the method of some subject. Here subject is already an interface. So we want to have this request method. Um, in order to do that, we could either create a concrete subject, so a, a subject which implements this subject interface, or we could implement a proxy which uses this concrete subject under the hood. So it, basically, this is again the same idea as an adapter uh, that we, as the object adapter that we use another object under the hood, but in this case, the interface stays the same. The adapter changed the interface, the proxy leaves the interface the same. The context is that we have some objects and these objects maybe sometimes need long to load or should have additional things checked before we access them. So we need some versatile references to these objects. And the problem is now, how can we handle such objects which are not directly accessible? And of course, the answer is to use a proxy. For example, objects could be in different address spaces. For this, a remote proxy or a communication proxy would be interesting. Um, and this proxy has the, has the task of dealing with this serialization and the communication parts in between. Or um, the object takes very long to create. For this, we could use this lazy loading um, proxy, so a virtual proxy, which um, which represents the object, the original object, but just as a handle. And um, if we want to to access the uh, properties of the object, then we create the object actually. And this could then take some time. Or we want to check the access rights of objects. Can every object be accessed by all, um, by all our threads in our application? Or maybe we want to restrict our access rights. Also proxies can be uh, used as smart references, for example, smart pointers or unique pointers. So they should behave like pointers, but have some additional semantics behind, behind them. So the solution is um, to give a, a reference, a placeholder class to the client, which uh, has the same interface, but accesses the real object underneath. And of course, um, it should reroute all the calls to the real object. It should act like the real object or, or subject. It's always called subject in this pattern. Um, yeah, so it's completely transparent to the user that the object isn't, for example, at the own machine, but at another machine. And that's the idea of the proxy. So the consequences is it introduces another level of indirection. So he, this can actually be a, a drawback also. For example, performance-wise, we have another call, another layer in between of the direct object. Um, but for the proxy, we can, we can use this, for example, for housekeeping and for storing references and only loading these resources, which we really um, need. So yeah, um, a remote proxy can decouple client and server. So it can be that we communicate via the network without even knowing it. So remote uh, procedure calls a proxy for remote procedure calls would be perfect for this. Um, then a virtual proxy can perform optimizations by loading objects later on, only when we need it. C a caching proxy and caching and pooling is an, a design pattern which we will handle in later lectures. But the caching proxy could, for example, reuse objects 
So we don't call the, the destructor immediately, but we reuse it for some other purpose. Or the security proxy could control access to the objects. So there are many, many things we can do with a proxy. Of course, we can overdo it. So if we use a proxy for a proxy for a proxy, uh, just to add more functionality and add uh, additional functionalities, um, this could be completely overkill. Similar to the adapter. With every layer of indirection we add, we get less efficient. Uh, of course, compilers can do some optimizations, but yeah, it's, it's, this, is, this is limited.